and I'm in the Ulster Museum. Uh, this is the best museum in the whole of Ireland, north or south, and I'm in the art zone. And I'm in especially to see the two Rembrandts that have been given to the Ulster Museum. So this is the first time that the Ulster Museum will be able to say that we have two Rembrandts of our own. There's six of these etchings have been acquired by the Ulster Museum as part of a tax bill deal and they were gifted uh, to the Arts Council of England as part of the government acceptance in lieu scheme, whatever that is. But anyway, um, the Ulster Museum <laughs> are quite happy to, um, to acquire these six etchings. They, they're the first works by uh, this, uh, you know, Rembrandt, the Dutch master, to be acquired by the museum. Now, um, Rembrandt has been displayed in the museum, but, but it's just on loan. Um, so this is the first time that they, they actually be owned by them. And apparently uh, only two of the displays are, are uh, featured today in the Dutch Masters exhibition, but they will be... Uh, They will be putting the other six on display, uh, or the other four on display, with the other two at some uh, other juncture. Um, these, the, the record that these um, etchings were painted uh, between the 1630s and 1650s. Now I might not be able to video them. Um, I presume I'm able to take a non-flash photograph of them, uh, so I'll do that if I'm not allowed to video them. Okay, onward and upward. And there's just lots to see here. I was in this gallery there now, um, and they have an exhibition of uh, Dutch landscapes and the two uh, etchings by Rembrandt are in there, but I'm not allowed to video or photograph um, in that in that gallery. Uh, just not allowed. And then uh, you don't question these things. Anyway, uh, I just encourage you to come and see it, see them for yourself. Um, the two pieces in question are. Just getting my notes out. Uh, I'm trying to find them. Well, there's a nativity, Dutch uh, nativity. Aye, six is bridge, and the adoration of the shepherds. And they were scraped onto copper plate, I believe, and then the copper plate was dipped in ink and then it was transferred onto uh, paper almost like a, an early form of uh, printing press so there you go the uh, Austria Museum are well pleased to get these